<laughs> what? Oh, I'm gonna cry. <laughs> I'm not filming my face. I'm only filming your face because you're a way prettier cryer than I am. But it needs the bow, damn it. Go get the bow. Oh, you go get it. <laughs> Gabrielle, I already did the job of getting the car. I don't need to be getting the bow, too. Right. Now, Gabrielle, an amazing woman, bought this car for herself. He literally manipulated her into saying that Jack bought this car for me. He's the best boyfriend. But he did not buy it for her. And he would always use the excuse that like, oh, when we get married, it's gonna be our money anyway. Like, it'll all be ours. But guess what? You didn't get married. You broke up because you treated her like crap. And that's just like the whole thing about the relationship is he was always holding something over her head. I know you guys been waiting for a long time to know the truth and it's gonna be quite disappointing, but here it is. He spit on her and called her a C word. Constantly acted like she was a sexual object. Financially took advantage of her. Threatened to kill her if she acted out of line. Wouldn't allow her to hang out with friends or do anything that he wasn't involved in. At one point he wouldn't even let her tag her sister in pictures because he didn't want her to get any of the followers. Forced her to lie about her car. He wouldn't allow her to go to parties with him because he wouldn't get hit on as much. Told her that the dogs do more than her and nothing she did was right. Called her worthless and put every problem of his onto her. Here's a part two to my last video. Um, he made her cry her freaking eyes out at her birthday. Wouldn't even come to her birthday party because he, I don't know, he's too good or whatever, and he forgot her birthday the first time. He forced her, her to like not be able to hang out with her family and really drove like a knife in between her relationship with her parents and her siblings. He has been going out and has a separate Instagram, so he hasn't been sad like he said he's been. He hasn't even said sorry but he has been with a bunch of other girls. And personally, to me, he forced her to ditch me on my birthday. So that was real sweet. And I know this may come to a shock to most of y'all, but I'm sorry. I don't know what even the point of this was besides to blatantly attack me and get people to dislike me for absolutely no reason. And when I say no reason, I mean this reason. I don't mean I haven't been mean to Gabrielle on occasion. I haven't acted out of line. I haven't said things that I don't regret. Like I've certainly have, I, or that I have regret. I do regret, my bad. I've said things that I regret. I've done things that I regret. I've, like this happens. Unfortunately, it was happening too often and that's why we broke up or at least that's one of the reasons we broke up But to suggest that I didn't care about this whole thing was such a disrespectful Disgusting reach that I know you know isn't true So this is the next point that I think most people are interested in and it's been twisted to make me look like this manipulative monster that made my ex do everything for me and I just forced her to do everything. This is certainly not true. I think that's obvious to most people, but unfortunately there are people that believe. So, we're going to talk about something, something that has been blowing up my DMs, something that everyone knows about, um, and that's just me being replaced. Anyways, it happens. People move on. That's just life, and that is a-okay. I'm so happy that people can find other people. That's absolutely amazing. It just takes different people a certain amount of times to move on. Some people are quicker than others. Some are a little bit slower. I want to be honest with you guys because I've hid my feelings in the past, and I always act like things are okay when they're not, and I put on this smile, and I put on this front sometimes that makes it seem like I don't care or it makes it seem like I'm just masking my feelings which is what I do sometimes uh, but I do want to be honest with you guys about my mental state and my mental health and like where I've been because this has really affected me I mean 
of course it has. And there's also been like a lot of hateful comments again. Like I did expect it, but come on, I'm a human, guys. Let's not be completely. Yeah, she's like a YouTuber. They were I'm both here. YouTubers, and uh, it's funny because she lives in Missouri, which mm -hmm. right and like. Yep. And oh. I just ended up being out here in LA, and we met up. Now, but her ex made a video. This. Three million views and in that video he didn't even talk about why they broke up and there's a lot of controversy around like why they broke up and like I no wanna... one really knows no one knows like so could you tell me maybe I'll like... tell you a little bit yeah oh. okay. nah but we're just here chilling and uh, you guys made a channel together yeah it's like a family channel mm -hmm. I kind of did that too and I ran with the channel ah nah, nah. so y'all made a family channel man mm -hmm. honestly guys I'm not like being biased because I'm on her side or on his side but that channel was both of them like it wasn't like he was already big before like regardless he took the channel I know but I also had my channel too no but so. he took the channel bro. nah so he ended up changing their couple's channel he changed it from Jack and Gab to just his own name it's his own channel like he just made it his own channel man yo that yeah. sounds a little something that I did uh -huh. but listen I don't want to put you on the spot i'm not sure if you know this no, i'm nervous when i was on his new channel he got a new girl yeah i'm happy for him though you, he oh. is happy now guys okay. who would do that who would take a couple's channel and get a new girl on it who would do that <laughs> i wonder oh my goodness who would ever do that but now nah, homie caught the little asian too no but the views ain't hidden like they used to with you oh. i don't want to make things weird can we click on a video oh that's so weird i haven't watched any of them that's so this weird. This is my first time seeing it. Nah, so I was actually in a serious relationship too. Not a serious, so she dated a dude for four years. Four and a half, almost I dated for one year and I thought I was in something. I got over my relationship and stuff. That's why I always joke around about it. How are you doing? Cause like, I don't, I feel like we're friends I mean, now. I'm just trying to check up on you and your mentalness. You know, it just like takes time to like heal and move on, but it's so important to find happiness again and like that's what he's doing so it's good it's all love it's all love but look it's public it's on the interwebs it so is. we're gonna be keeping an eye out Aww. yo how do you feel like do you think she's cute yeah i think they're cute together they compliment each other really well Aww. really yeah they they bounce off of each other the energy's there but yo she's just being wait are you being serious no i'm being serious and we gotta replay that yo what was hold on hold on hold on um, what look, are you doing? Look, 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 look. Oh, my. Oh, how do you feel? Oh, she's like, oh. I'm like, ah, my heart. That should have been my leg. <laughs> nah, I'm just kidding. Oh, my. I wonder how they even met. Like, well, how did. No, no, no. I know her. Like, everyone thinks, like, I don't know this girl. I played soccer with her. We went to the same high school. Like, I, I know her. Oh. <laughs> The reason why I'm kind of freaking out is because they met, dated for four years when they were in high school. Keep in mind, he wasn't really YouTube famous. I mean, he does have two million followers, so I mean... He has some clout. Girls nowadays kind of go towards that. He should have got an Instagram model. He should have got like a, like, so he got a girl that he been new, bro. I don't want to be mean. I don't want to be... She's pretty. She's pretty. All I'm saying is... You thought I, he was going to get like a model... I expected, I expected more out of him, man. But listen, as long as he's happy. We'll see you in the next one, baby. Oh.